Hello, folks, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. All right, Minsky is in the party. We're going to try this out, see how this goes. Ranger rogue abilities, we'll see. He's doing some neat little yoga over here. Here, you bounce a little bit off there. You bounce. You're, okay, well, that's fine. All right, let's go ahead and take Minsk shopping. We don't have anything on us right now. He needs at least some good armor. Um, okay, we're in the vault right now. I don't think that actually matters. I mean, I guess we could try picking a lock here, but these locks are going to be notoriously difficult. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. I'm trying to think, like, where exactly we need to go for shopping trip. Um, let's go. He has already been looted, right? I mean, if you want some murderous cuts for some extra cash, but it doesn't really matter. We have 26,000. We should be able to afford something. Yeah, this is the artillerist. That was one of the good guys. This is not a good guy. Oh, he's been looted already. All right. Oh, so we got to go the long way for this, don't we? Okay, hold on. Let's go to a waypoint. I don't even know. Lower City Central Wall? I have no clue. Well, this is near the Sorcerer's Sundries. This might be right. Yeah, okay. Alright. This could work out. Down here, we have these merchants. We definitely sold things to. We don't want to buy stuff back. Easier to... Don some yeah, armor, yeah, yeah, yeah. then learn to swing a sword. Okay, we definitely if you can manage aware. the extra weight, that is. Okay. So we can see what Minsk has here. Hey, Minsk. And your sword's not terrible, right? Yeah, okay, because we gave you a loot. Okay. No, no, that, that could work. That could totally work for you. So I'm not worried too much about the blade. It's more your other armor. Alien Stutter Leather could be okay. I mean, plus two initiative, two initiative rolls is all right. I don't know if you actually need stealth or not. Reviving Hand is not your bag. Nothing else here is magical. And fortunately, it looks like we did not give you most of the magic gear. All right, we don't care too much about the armor. I guess, is there any good armor in here for you? Any of it named? Named armor is really what I want to go for here. The Alien Star Letters are the only thing that seems to be named. Could give you half plate, but I'm not sure about half plate on a rogue or a ranger for that matter. But the armor classes are better, obviously. Um, okay, none of it is named. Which is too bad. Okay, so the benefit to being in light armor is that we still get the dexterity bonus. I mean, he does have full dexterity at 18. It's not terrible. Get 16, that's up to 18. What's your dex, what's your AC now, Minsk? I don't think a shield's gonna work for you. I mean, it might, but a shield plus one's definitely not gonna be the right thing. Though, this looks like the wrong guy to go to, doesn't it? Okay, let's just make sure I don't have anything too special. I want. Why don't I have a bone in my inventory right now? That's just silly. Bunch of arrows, which is good. But if Mince is going to be our ranger, like, maybe he should have the arrow? Maybe we need to get him a bow. Oh, didn't we see a bow on the other merchant? That sounds really familiar. The way I see it. You've yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Okay, what about you, lady? Something caught your eye, then? Careful. Most of my wares can take an eye right out. <laughs> okay, we did see a bow over here. It's dead shots. It doubles proficiency bonus and rolling. Range attack this weapon unless they have disadvantage. I mean, that's pretty good. So that'd be Minsk. I mean, he's got no other... I'm getting that or his range attack might not be a horrible idea. What's this one over here? There's a plus one sword sword. It's not that great. Okay, I mean, yeah, maybe. 
Flail of Ages is not great. Let's get you the dead shot. It's only 770. That's actually pretty cheap. Go into Will. Okay, hold on. Uh, yeah, there it is. Hand that to... Oh, okay. We can't hand that over right now. There's nothing else here we want, right? I mean, maybe, maybe some special arrows. I suppose we can divide them, like, half and half. Yeah. But right now, not really. Yeah, we'll see how Mince goes. As a rogue, he should get a distance... Um, sneak attack. My weapons won't be beat. Tell you. Okay. So let's make sure to give that to Minsk. But unfortunately, no gloves, no cape, no nothing. So we'll have to go into the next fight. Sleep kind of with one eye open, evil. Maybe both. Now he's got the dead shot. I mean, maybe. This is a 200 sword, though, right? Actually, no. It's not. I mean, you can wield it with both now. You don't need to. Okay. Yeah, no rings or anything. Okay, let's go to Sorcerer's Sungrace. Might be some good stuff the there. People. I just hate to go kind of naked with mints. Like, that seems like a really bad idea. I don't remember how much of this stuff it is actually. Minsk has never trusted this. places such as this. I'm just talking to the... Yeah, there we go. Talk to the Welcome back to feast your eyes. Uh, mostly spell scrolls. Okay, no, there are a couple of things here. All right, I mean that's something. Every spell doesn't matter. That's not terrible either, right? It's not great, but it's not terrible. Uh, restoration does not matter for Minsk. And Sword of the Emperor's kind of garbage. I mean, plus you saving most bonus against throw spells is nothing, but it's not great. Uh, spell save DC doesn't really matter. Yeah, really, these are meant to be for uh, like different builds for Gale. It's not really helpful. All right, let's go ahead and get the Masterwork Gauntlets. Um, I suppose the boots, too. Which is at least something magical for Mansky. It's not much, but it's something. I don't know if we want to buy into the spells right now. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, getting out a brand new character this late in the game is going to be a little difficult. Hopefully we'll run against some loot later, but I don't know exactly what that would be. I'm just double checking my inventory to make sure I'm not missing anything out here, but I think we're good. Alright, close up. Please. Okay, so hand that stuff to me. Oh, actually. Yeah, yeah. I haven't been scrapped. Sword at better. my side and hamster at hand. Okay, so where this? much, but it's something. Yeah, we need to get some rings, buddy. Let's see what we can do. Okay, I'm really curious to test him out in battle. The pride Where's of the a gate. good place to go? Well, we've still got... Right, we still gotta go to hell. That's still a thing. Um, there's the submarine trip here, which we can do. I feel like we're missing something else. Let me look at the journal. Quick. Okay, Thieves Guild's gonna help us out. That's great news. Let's see, yeah, okay, Raphael's still doing that. We still need to free Orpheus, which means we need to go to hell and get the hammer. Right, right. This is mostly just using the stuff I'm not gonna use. Right, that's the hammer. That's rescuing the Duke, which we need to go to the submarine for. Oh, look for Oscar and Baldur's Gate, dude. I have no idea where the hell that is. Um, okay, yeah, yeah, Red Hammer, the divisor we're going to deal with, so that's the submarine. Read the artist. Oscar and Bubble, I have no idea. Yeah, Dribble's body parts are somewhere around here. Oh, and Thrumbo. Thrumbo's gonna go get a boat somewhere in the water. Okay. 
Okay, no, no, we can do that. That sounds like a fight. Where would that be? Um, so we saw. Is that why you keep your head shaved? I assumed it was a custom of some sort. Oh no! <laughs> Most warriors of Rashiman wear long battle braids, weighed down with stone. Minsk can show you. We next we can. Thank you, but I'm more wizard than warrior. Not sure my scalp would stand up to such a plating. I mean, now I kind of want to see it. Right, so I think. Right, we need to go towards the water. Didn't we see somebody? Yeah, trouble is I don't remember exactly where. I thought we saw an undead guy in like an abandoned building somewhere. I'm just trying to remember where that was. Uh, let's definitely go downstairs. It was towards that way. But that's the only way really to get to the water. Yeah, there are the docks over there. You mustn't. The city is full of criminals. We can't let them know they're vulnerable. Right, this is Thieves Guild area here. Hate us from Don't know if we need to necessarily get past her, but we could if we wanted to. Um, in here? Yeah, there was a, like, like a, there was an undead guy, like, wandering around one of the abandoned houses. I just don't remember where that was. Oh, there's a waypoint here. So I suppose that could be hopefully indicative. Oh, some red over here. Hold on. Some bad guys inside this building somewhere. Something over there. Okay, sure. Take up the dirt mount. I mean, I'm just exploring. I guess we really haven't finished our exploration of Baldur's Gate, have we? Okay, Tremaine Ring just add to wares and smoke powder arrow send to Miss. There's bad guys inside. Oh, okay. So that's the that's. Hmm. I don't know. We need to talk to the thrombo first, though. Yeah, Togo's mention's not gonna help. We need to actually go to wherever the hell the. That might work. Okay. Around. All right. That's curious. Don't steal the rotten fish. Be kind of silly to go for. Oh, there's uh, something over there. Oh, it's a tiny little hole, isn't it? Tempers are rising. Oh, come on. It's clear not everything. Are you kidding me? The wooden chest is stealing. The wooden chest is stealing. Uh, there's totally a hole there that maybe like you here I could go through in a, in a different form. Okay. They've got fish here all the while. Oh. Hello? Okay, oh, okay, I was gonna say, I didn't steal anything. Alright, well, Mince gets to go first, because he's like that. Well, Mince, let's try out your battle prowess here. There's a lot of bad guys here. They're all nicely grouped. Well, for now, two of these guys, looks like that guy and this guy get to go first. I do have advantage on hitting him, which is great. Right, let's see if we can keep them where they are. So Whose over here. battle cry is too high for your hearing? All right, let's but try. You tremble all the same. And we could do a nice little hail of thorns. And maybe a fuller loop here. For the, let's go and do a. All enemies have a 1d4 penalty to charisma, wisdom, intelligence saving throws. And they receive an extra thunder damage. Let's do it. Okay, good shrieking. Which I think might be it. I don't think we can do much else. Oh, you can hunters mark somebody. Also, Dread Ambusher. First turn of each combat, I'm going to start with additional swift and precise attack. We might be able to do it. Oh, not quite enough movement to get over there. Not enough movement to do it. Alright, so I'm just not close enough. That's too bad. All right, then Hunter's Mark's not a horrible idea. Let's go ahead and Hunter's Mark. That guy. Okay, so that's about all we can do with you, Minsk. This is my time. All right. Will. I'm not 
cloud of daggers on Mint's backside. We'll make sure nobody approaches it from that angle. Anything else we can do. I don't think these guys are likely to go invisible. So, like, fairy fire is probably not helpful. Shatter, though. Shatter could be really good. Oh, you know what? I forgot to turn on... We're back at this. That's okay. Okay, so I can shatter these three guys. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do it. I think that's fine. Let's do it. Okay, I mean, that's some, some damage. Not too bad. Uh, let's see what else we got. We can challenge one of them to a duel. Yeah, let's do that with that one. Challenge you. I always save, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, worth a shot. I can't do armor batteries right now, so... So Alright, you're probably just gonna shoot me. Yep, let you in. Uh sure, why not? Shield up. Fix it against that probably. That was pretty good. Okay, good whiff on Gale. Gale gets to go now. I mean another shatter probably wouldn't be a horrible idea. Probably in the same group will did. So right there, please. Nice. Took out one of them. That's all you can do, right? That's all you can do. You could misty step, but I don't think you really need it. Oh, did you hear us down the frickin'... No, why did you hear us? Okay, we need to get her in the party here. Whatever it takes. Especially as she's being... Your friend is being a... Compensation for the item you just damaged. All right. Well, I'll pay for you it. Never knew vandalism could prove so costly. Perhaps next time you'll be more careful. Will I though? It seems unlikely. All right. Did that put her? That did not put her in the freaking thunder wave again to put you in the water. Though it really doesn't seem like that would kill you, huh? Let's do this really quick. Did join the battle. That's good at least. Just jump the character in turn. He will. Alright, well he came right up to you. Might as well go ahead and poke him. I don't think we need it. I think he's dead. Oh, he did not die. He did. Oh no, no, he's dead. He's dead. Okay, good. Alright, then go ahead and Elder Blast this guy. Or we could just pierce and strike him, that's better. I found my mark. Blast anybody else. I could theoretically do her enthusiasm somebody, but I think there's nobody here. Alright, enter. Swallow your battle cries, fiend, and wash them down with steel! Okay, I mean, sneak attack, maybe? With advantage on this guy? Not advantage on him. Oh, what if we get. Okay, no. Hold on, maybe if we bring. Bring Will over. So we have a. You actually can do that. Counts your own turn. You come over here. Oh, not enough movement. Jump over here. Also, not enough movement. I was hoping it would be enough to actually get you over here. Two steps at a time. I need enough movement to actually attack it, right? Indeed. Now, just barely out of range. So I think that means you don't have advantage on it. Maybe next turn. Uh, go ahead and poke him, I guess. Disengage. Range damage twice is the highest result. Oh, that's kind of cool. It doesn't help us right now, but that's good to know it exists. Alright, go ahead and lacerate this guy. Oh, big old whip. That's too bad. That's better though. And might as well go ahead and pommel strike. Alright, you resist. Hello. Fortunately, the next. Otherwise, that range follow would be really bad. Oh, 
he stepped right outside the Shriek. Okay, I see how it is. Right, come in right over here. I wonder if the Thunder would actually be useful here. Right. Oh, so don't hit the Sivvy. Okay, don't hit the Sivvy. But otherwise, yes, that'll probably work. Saving on the hunter's mark, right? Okay. And he jumped. I don't know how that's supposed to go, but okay. But now I should have an advantage on you. So now we can go and see. Good break. That guy's out. Okay, that's pretty solid. Um, you could go ahead and charge this guy. That was also a solid hit. Sadly, I think we're out of moves. Guess I could carry the Hunter's Mark over. I'm not sure that matters. Don't need for the spell slot. Not that there's anything else to spend a spell slot on. Okay, so you're good. No holding back. I don't want to go engage this guy in melee. We could do it. We could do it. 95% chance to. Yeah, go for it with the hell. Oh, except then mints. Well, Miss can jump over here if this guy's still alive. Okay, let's do it. Let my enemies fool. Okay, good hits, good hits. Strike again. He's almost out. No, no. Okay, don't need Vince. We got this one last hit. That's it. Nice. Oh. Should be some severe penalties for that close. Oh, you actually shot Misk. All right, Gale. Simple attack. Eight points of damage. That's all we need. Eight little tiny points of damage. Ray of Frost, maybe just kill the cantrip. Could work. I mean, it's a hell of a damage range, right? Three to twenty-four. We might roll an eight. It could happen. Eight or higher. That's all we need. Black we have to actually hit first, though. All right, all right. Yep, that's how it is sometimes. Red in tooth and claw. All right, you hear it. You got a okay-ish bow, I guess. Also, with a cantrip. Actually, can you? Do you have any cantrips? Maybe you don't. Maybe I'm just wrong. I think I might just be wrong. Now, the trouble with the perfectly balanced strikes is we got to get in range first. I think a range attack instead. Not a great shot. Oh, no. oh, 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 oh. Regression. Oh, what the hell, man? I freaking... Did I kill somebody by knocking him into the water or something? Okay, at least we killed these guys, but maybe, maybe we didn't do well here. Smelly bat. I mean, take everything. I probably should have put it in inventory first. Smelly bat. Alright, yeah, okay, add that to wares. Let's not come up for ingredients. Add that to wares. Okay, where the hell is the smelly bag at? Uh, bags are usually up, right? So here it is, this thing. It reeks of rotten fish. Okay, well, we got some fish we can send to camp, at least. If you're reading this, I'm probably dead. Trapped underwater by madmen and fish fox. Explosive everywhere. No way out. Praying for help. Marjorie, Quentin, Holly, I love you all. Oh, okay. Somebody's dead. Oh, is this guy died? Sailor Pete. Oh, no, he's just prone. He's just prone. He's just fine. He's fine. These fish we can go ahead and take to camp. That will just add the wares. I'm mostly having Gale do this in case there's any more alchemical grenade for ants. Might not be. But hey, right there, actually. Uh, spear, I swear. Okay. And this guy. Hello, Shining One Hunter. More grass, and of course. A starfish. Okay, just a collectible wear item. Okay. Really all that 
Gordon. Uh, Will, are you following? Will is not following. Why? Oh, because Will's talking. Thank you for cutting those creatures down, truly. Gods know what would have happened if you weren't here. Oh, that's why we got the reward. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Nasty blighters. They smell like a fish barrel left to rot in the sun. There is a merchant nearby. Source? Yes. There's nobody here. Okay. Not what I wanted then, I guess. Nope, this was not the house I was thinking of. There's I told you a house with a dead guy in it. I just don't remember where he is. Because we walked past him, I could have sworn, but it well, must not have been here, right? Because we would have gotten pulled into this fight for sure. Okay, it wasn't here. Not that I remember where it was. Probably just a dead cat. Okay, yeah, yeah, the dead guy's over there. Okay, a bunch of broken down stuff over here. Was it over here? No, there's nobody. Nobody lives here. Little chest tucked away, but apparently we've either already looted it or it was already empty. All right, so that's the thieves' guild area. So probably nothing we need necessarily. Yeah, a bunch of thieves' guild stuff and some broken down buildings, which we don't really care about. Okay. Now it said it had to be near the water, right? Because he's supposed to be trying to get away or something. Down the stairs, and oh, was it up the stairs? I'm just gonna keep on going here till we find it. Right, dead body over there. We can't really do anything with it. Right, right. We we murdered everyone in this building, so that's just how that is. An entire edition dedicated to one lord and his metal toys. Okay, there's water over here, but no docks to get to. Yeah, but that's the, that's the way inside to the undead dude, right? Yeah, 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 so that's not it. He's gonna be real pissed. That's why it's all red there, I think, is why all the bad guys are red there, is because they would fight us on site, I believe, because we did not complete our objective. The trouble is I have no idea where the hell this guy even is. We gotta go like building to building here. Inside this building? I don't even remember. The door's not open. Flim's cobbler's. I mean, sure. Okay, that's cool. Latest boulder's mouth edition. Oh, that's curious. What's curious? It really needs to glow better. Sorry to hear. I don't see it. And we could talk to Dravo Flim, but I'm not sure that matters. It's okay, so it's not here. Though that is a merchant. Actually, some fancy shoes might not go amiss, I suppose. Be very welcome to Flim's Cobblers, humble family home of our Archduke Enver Gortash. Oh, well then he should have He may die, not right. have followed in his old man's shoe steps, but Archduke's not so bad, is it? Okay, let me just see your wares. So we could oh we just have regular old shoes. Okay, let me sell my wares then, and that'll do it for today. Finest leather in the city. Ask anyone. I mean, now I'm kind of suspicious, right? Like, is he actually related to Gortash? I mean, I guess there's a possibility there that he could actually be related, but... I don't know. Seems odd. Seems odd. I don't know. What is this? Old Garlos. I don't think anybody's... Is this the one with the Hag Society? Because we totally did this. No yeah, because we had to come down, right? But that's not <laughs> where... There is not so bracing as a good battle role. Do you not agree? Yeah, I kind of think I should have more class to you. That's fine. Oh, boo! A challenge! Oh no, here we go. I cannot let this go unanswered. One, two! Ay, boo, come now. See how our friend trembles? You have taken the chest too far. The 
seen any gazetteers around. Trembling in see if the new additions out yet. Criminals. Okay, it's got to be around the. Okay, so it's not going to be at the bank. That's just absurd. There's no way that's. Somewhere along the water line, there's got to be a house or something. Okay, that's the submarine area. We don't want to go there. Now, I feel like we missed it. We already talked to these guys. Yeah, that goes into the Thieves Guild loading area, which we've kind of already worked well. We're, we're pretty much done with that area. Hmm. Thing is, I'm not sure where else it would be. Yeah, this goes too far over the other way. Now, this seems wrong. This seems wrong. Let me look around again. Yeah, we've pretty much covered the entire... I mean, it could be, I guess, up here, right? This is technically a water area, but only technically. Got stripes on the sails. Aren't those stripes? I see stripes. Those are spots, you idiot. There's a cache near Garlo's place. I guess we could go back. Okay, you know what? Take me back over here. Yeah, fast travel to here. Not to mention the parchment quality of that. Awful. Okay. I don't know how far down we can go. What about the gazebo on the water there? Is there anything good there? I don't remember actually going out that far. Talk to you guys, but it seems unlikely to give me anything. Just discussing the weather, dearie. Nothing of interest to you. Okay. Probably, I mean, they're definitely working on a deal, but nothing I can do really do about. Going into the house there is not really going to be helpful. Heroic picture of Gortash. Lord Enver Gortash, the people's man, the gate's protector. Okay, then. And this is where the fishman jumped out. So, oh, it doesn't seem. Oh, there's a hatch over here. Where's the hatch at? I'm a carcass. That thing's been dead for a while. Gotta get around. I really feel like it should be. If it's not gonna be here, let's at least try the hatch, I guess. Maybe someone's hiding in the hatch. Uh, hatch would be over here. Oh, here, the hatch, okay. Locked. All right, Mince, here's where we try out your Evil hides abilities here. and Boo seeks. Boo would squeeze through, but he would just have lunch. Okay, yeah, sleight of hand proficiency and the sleight of hand expertise will definitely give us what we need here. I hope we should put that on Carlac. I mean, might as well go ahead and add... No, we don't have Guidance. It's going to be fine, then. I only have three, three Thieves tools. Wow, just what I needed. Okay. I mean, the 15 getting a 27 is not bad. Been down here before? This does not look familiar. The Pride of the Gate. We might as well go ahead and add some stuff to wares. Uh, Steel next. Sharp. Hamster hungry. Okay, go ahead and grab the silver plates. Pick that up and wares. Uh, we've got a stuffed bear, which I'm sure is adorable, but not necessarily helpful. And yeah, just some garbage around. Nothing real. At the end of the rows of books. Uh, the True and Impossible Adventures of Volo. Yeah, yeah, just add that to wares. And a whole bunch of barrels and boxes galore that don't actually have much in them. Okay, what's in the door? Oh, traps galore. Like. Well, Mince, we're going to keep on trying you out here. See how this goes. Okay. 
a little scary. I don't know what the times one is, but we're gonna go with it. I guess we'll go ahead and light up the torch because it didn't hurt. Nice and careful here, guys. Oh, there's Trump. another one. Step soft, boot. So far, so good. Yeah, okay. That proficiency bonus is really good, and maybe we should think about respecking more characters into that. Though, if Vince stays in the party, like, maybe we'll just keep him here. But if we're going to have Karlak back. We should definitely make sure she has a step soft boot. That she has these bonuses. Why is this trapped all to hell? I think it just goes outside. Okay, so 31 is possible. That's good to know. Nothing inside the trunk. Any of the trunks? Nothing. Why is this trapped all to hell? Yeah, nothing inside any of the crates, metal or otherwise. Wish the best it seems unlikely. Yeah, just some rotten food. That's That's got to be an incredible smell you've just discovered. Yeah, rotten baskets. What's with the freaking... Okay, so where does this go, I guess? You go outside? Um, let's try jumping, I guess. Not enough space. There is a lever over here. So, okay, we definitely want to do that. Uh, let's see. Here? Not enough space. Okay, maybe it's just not enough space for the mist. Of the let's gate. try. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Let's try armor back at this here. There's not much, but it's a little bit. Okay. You try jumping. Yeah, there's not enough space here either. If you just step forward like a little bit. Now, I kind of feel like we need to climb up. There's no climb going to happen. Okay, you know what? There's a lot of crates around. We can just climb a crate, right? So let's move one of the crates underneath the hole there. Come on. Come on. Okay, we need somebody stronger. Hold on. Back up, everybody. I mean, it's your pretty Justice right? walks on four feet I mean, look and strong. sleeps in my boot. Okay, go ahead and move that over here. And climb on top of it. There you go. Then jump. Not enough space still. Move over a little bit. Not enough space. Damn it. Come on. I mean, I guess we would just shoot the lever. Yeah, you know what? We can totally shoot the lever from here. We don't actually need to go up to it. So here, shoot the lever. Aha! Okay, that's good enough. And this is why I was trapped all to hell. Not that there appears to be anybody in here. Scrapbook of love letters, some individual pieces of gold. Oh, this probably goes out to the dock where we were just at, huh? Someone just protecting her life, I guess. Oh, here. Soft. Definitely disarm that. Okay, 15. Doable. No worries. No worries at all. Okay, Mints. Yeah, I think you might have just earned yourself a place in this party here, bud. Oh, there's nothing in here. Alright, hand that to Gale. Just, uh, chemical ingredients, whatever. Um... Okay, so the acid barrel would have blown up if the trap had gone off, no doubt. There's nothing else here we really want, is there? Yeah, little bits and pieces of gold, and that's about it. Yeah, some rotten tomatoes, that's always great, thanks. Someone's very rotten bed, they've probably been back for a while. Smuggler's note, okay, that'll at least clue us in what's going on here. Hey, why not? Sure, I can get you and your wage servant Billy out of town without Captain Grizzly or the flood tide knowing. We made that abandoned beach house, you know, when the moon rises on the night of 14th Marpal. Bring that began be gem to dagger I like. 1486 in a different hand. Hard to tell what that means. Select the torch. Backpack here with okay. 
a number six key. That's good to know. It's real nice. What about the chest here? I'm on the chest directly in front of you. This thing. What about this thing? That's nothing, is it? Okay. All right. Well, we can go back to the county house and open up uh, safe number six. Might give us something good. Like the, that's just a placemat in front of there. And we can grab some silver, but I'm not sure it's actually going to be helpful. Maybe this scrapbook. This salt-stained scrapbook contains a dozen envelopes glued to its inner pages. Perhaps these envelopes once contained letters, but now all are gone but two. Letter one to Winky. Oh, Winky, how I long to be away with you on the open seas, away from what grim old flood tide. A way where I can love you freely and without fear. With my ability to charm fish in the waves, we'll never lack for food. You know I never tire of your chowder. Letter two, dear Salty, the Moo Jays. I'll show them to you. I'll show them to you last and we'll dance on them silver beaches on the silver moonlight, but I don't want to trouble on our sea journey. So first I must make my peace with Umberly with a grand donation. Not much longer, Salty. I don't know if we necessarily need that, but we'll go ahead and take it. What the hell? And yeah, then there's just bits and pieces of gold, right? Rusty dagger, one or two bits and pieces of gold, which I guess we could take, but yeah, only one at a time, so not really worth it. Right, we can go back to the county house at least. But that does not help us find old man Thrumbo. Where the hell he went. Right, back up the ladder. Yeah, here, Do something, on. says Boo. Uh, what, are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Use the ladder to get to the hatch. What are you doing? Mean? There you go. That was weird. Okay, I mean, cute. Nice to have a little bit of, I don't know, flavor around, I guess, but it doesn't really do anything for us. There's nobody here. Uh, sure, climb the vines. Maybe there's something up here that I missed out on. Or not. A bunch of burlap sacks, nothing really neat. This is the Thesial area again, right? I mean, there is a symbol here. Let's see what this is on. But what's here? Oh, this goes to the Undercity. Okay, so that gets that gets his temple there. Okay. And we haven't been over here, I guess. There could be something over this way, but I don't know how much of that we can actually go to. Like, if we start over there, we can look over at it, but that's about it. There's a little bit up here, but that's not going to be worth throwing, but he's supposed to be near the water, right? Let me look at the journal again. Yeah, I found the zombie lumbar. I told us Thrumbo was going to get a boat. He must be hiding somewhere near the water. I don't know, but where, though? All right, we still need to go confront Arfur or Gregorio. That'd be good, too. Right, Amelium is missing, right? Got a lot of giant hill giant strength. Oh, those are those are inside the house hook. Okay. Yeah, we need to go to Kazador's Palace for sure, but yeah, where in the world is frickin' Thrumbo? We can just pass by here, right? Yeah, okay, we're good. Now I mean we don't really I mean, I don't think there's any, gonna be anybody in here. We can take a look. I don't think there's anybody here. Like, the revealed entrance is just gonna go back down to the Undercity. And I guess Thrumbo could be in the Undercity, but that, for some reason, that seems unlikely. Right, there's the dead guy here, but the investigation is pretty much over, right? We already took care of everybody. Criminals. We can't let them know we're vulnerable. Took care of in both senses of the word. And we're just looping. And we're just looping. That's the dead guy over there. Um, did we check? Okay, yeah, this is just a bunch of houses of nothingness. There's no people in here. Yeah, we're looping around. That's the problem. We just keep on looping. We just keep on looping. All right, maybe I need to look this up. Seems like there's got to be a nice, easy way to get the Thrumbo that I'm just missing out on. Now, maybe when I blew up the fireworks factory, maybe that caused other issues. Yeah, 
can put these up again. And it's possible that we waited too long, right? That the mission just auto failed at some point, and that's why these guys are pissed at me. We have to fight the undead guys off because I failed a quest. That would kind of suck. I'm not sure where else it would be. Yeah, dead guys there. There's gotta be something we can do with those guys, too. But otherwise, near the water is kind of vague. The thing is, they're undead, right? So they're not going to be able to just hang out for very long. Not without people noticing them. Take a peek over here. Yeah, that's the old Garlow's place. Okay, so that's where the house of Hag, or the, the Hag society is. That's one of the cobblers. A very strange door there. Goes nowhere. Maybe down from where the hack society is? Or anti hack society. I suppose we should say that correctly because they definitely would not be one to associate with hags. Now there's no other. There's no other house. There is a cache, which I guess we could go down for, right? Let's go down to the cache. Um, it's going to require some jumping, I believe, to get down to that beach. Ooh, wow, that's a lot of, actually, bad jumping. Okay. Is there no way to climb down safely? Like, 11 HP, I don't want to lose. I don't see a way to climb down safely. There's got to be a way, though. Like a, I mean, there's not going to be a ladder. See, this, this is why I want to keep on picking up rope. Tabletop adventure, I'd say, is there a way for me to mitigate the damage by tying the rope around one of these spars here and lowering myself down gently? You know, belaying down or something. But sadly, not an option in this game. And we can go all the way down through the counting house to get number six because we do have the key. And I guess we'll go ahead and do that. It's not really what I want to be doing right now, but I don't know what else to do. There's got to be a way to find Rumbo. Obviously, he's not going to be in the county house, right? That's just not going to be in That might be worth a look. Yeah, yeah, that's just some traps. No big deal. If we had actually, like, tried to battle our way in, I think it would have been an issue, but it's not real. It's not real. So at least you have the key for number six. Maybe there's actually keys for all of these. Just somewhere out in Baldur's Gate. Though if Vince can roll 30s on the regular, maybe we don't need keys. You know, with the slide of hand proficiency. I wonder if we could actually get that for Carlac. We'd have to take a look and see like what might actually what can go on. Alright, so number six is probably along a wall somewhere. So all the vault walls are down here. Come on, get off the damn stairs. There you go. Okay, that is number one, two, three, uh, four, five, six. So this one over here, maybe? Number four, five, six is over here. Okay. Oh, come on. You have the freaking key, though. All right. Can you just lock it this First thing? The pick I thought in the boot. Okay, it is a DC 30, so it is going to be a little tough. I'm going to go ahead and add the Bardic Inspiration. Cause what the hell? Just All right. I mean, that's a little rough, but we do have... Oh, we only have two more Thieves Tools. Okay. We need to buy some Thieves Tools. We lock pick again, so that just lost the thieves. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But the thing is, we have the key, though. Okay, hold on. Maybe, maybe only Will has the key. Hey, though I thought they shared keys, like some kind of weird hyperspace arsenal thing. Is that not a thing? Somehow that's not a thing. Okay, I thought we had it though. Let me look at the. I have a bunch of keys on my keychain here. Bunch of these, okay. 
But it would be like the last one we picked up. Number nine key. Thought we picked up number six. There's a number one key. Maybe Nina still needs a crack skull. Okay, so let's go over here to number one. Something we didn't already grab this. Uh, excuse me. I have the fucking key though. High security vault number one. Maybe that's different. Counting house. Oh, it doesn't say. It doesn't say high security number one. So maybe that's the difference. Like this one says high security vault number nine, but that just says counting house safe. So I think that's different than the high security ones. Okay, so where the hell are the regular safe keys? Or the regular saves, rather? Um, and there's a whole bunch of vaults up this way. Maybe that's where they are. Okay, use the passageway, and then up through this passageway, there were a bunch of vaults. Yeah, counting out vault. So this has got to be it. Maybe. So we have... Yeah, the doors through here that we looked at. Actually, there's a freaking... There's a ward here. I have no idea what this is going to do. Fuck it, let's try it. Oh, it just teleports me over. Okay, that's clever. That's clever. This is nothing. This is okay. Customer notice. Please wait here. A staff member will retrieve your items. And there doesn't seem to be a way to get actually inside. Our chest is empty. Okay, so all this does is teleport you out. Please refrain from entering until a staff member has opened the way for you. There are totally vaults there, so we need to, like, disable this teleportation rune or something? I don't even know how the hell you do that. If we could, like, mar one of the things here. I don't know. Try it. What if we shoot the runes? I don't know if it's actually a thing, but maybe. No sign of any, da any damage whatsoever. Somebody cast something really clever here, and I have no idea how to get past it, but those are probably... Yep, those are the actual vaults. Those are the actual vaults with the actual numbers on them. Yep, so we have the number one, number two, and number six keys, but we have to be able to get past this thing. And we can't even access number one if we can somehow disable this lift. Hmm. There's got to be a way to do it. Well, I'll figure it out. But right now, thanks for watching. This has been Baldur's Gate 3 on PC Universe. Here, PC Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.